What an upset, though. My goodness. All right. Starting out Pokemon Stadium. I'd gather... I... <laughs> I'd reckon that Gonard and Peach Fuzz are quite fun to the stage. They seem to have good success on it. Yeah, getting out of the way, that smash attack. I mean, that uh, jab, punishing with the smash attack. Very nice stuff. Run up, grab. Because that's the thing. When you're fighting Little Mac, you think, oh, he's just going to do unsafe stuff on my shield. And if you're a cloud player, you're going to just climb hazard on a shield. But what you don't expect is for Little Mac to run up and grab you, which is what Gonard did back there. Good spacing on the down tilt, not an up B range. Down tilt. All right. Running into the cr cross slash. Good damage there from Mortem. Throwing out the KO punch, but Sass getting out of the way just in time with that dash attack. Deep breathing on deck. Mortem just chasing Gonard down after uh, that jolt haymaker there. Uh, both red team players uh, closing in on rage percent there. Good up smash there from uh, Gonard. Uh, actually, excellent up smash there from Peach Fuzz. Sending Mortem to an early grave, relatively speaking. And now. Eh, even-ish, I'd say right now. Oh, no, never mind, spoke too soon. Mortem is dead, because of course, he is Cloud without limit off stage. And fighting a player like Petrus, you're going to get edge guarded. You will get edge guarded. All right. So, um, Gonard finally losing his first stock. Petrus holding on like a champ, though, playing for Kermit the Frog. Up throw on the platform. Not going to kill quite yet. Might be a little stale, honestly. Throws tend to stale pretty quickly. You know the fastest sailing move in the game, though, is like reuse Shoryuken. The true Shoryuken, specifically. Only use that stuff for. Oh, okay, good cross slash there. Only use that for killing, honestly. Never use it as a combo extender. Just go for the up B. Alright. But reuse not on screen, so it's irrelevant. Good cross slash there, getting some nice damage. Very well could have killed Gonard with the smash attack, I feel. Surprise, Stas has yet to lose her first stock. Then again, I'm not because it's Stas, but it's been over three minutes, uh, over two minutes. All right, unsafe forward tilt there. Mortem uh, for, uh, up being in the wrong direction, not going to get punished for it. Uh, nice blunderbuss shot. How did Stas do that? All right, run up one-two punch. Mortem in a very bad spot. Uh, he's, is he dead? Not quite. Uh, limit coming in clutch. All right, good one-two punch there from uh, Gonard, of course. King KO punch, doing a good, uh, doing a good job right now. Oh wait, I get it. King KO punch. Okay, clever, clever stuff. I like it. Everyone uh, except Stas under the last stock. Mortem hanging on for dear life right now. Limit on deck, so he's not gonna die to that edge guard, unfortunately, for the red team. Good up, you had a shield. It's a classic Mortem there. Hey, I'm a hypocrite. I'm Argo. Up, B had a shield. Belmont. All right, and now it's kind of an even game. Slight advantage for the blue team there. KO punch on deck. Let's see what Gonard does. That's it, there it is. Now it's a 2v1, good good KO punch. All right, oh, nice combo there. Narrowed up till I like it. Just keep the pressure up. Don't let him breathe. Won't let my mans breathe. All right, armoring through that with the upper. I'm surprised it didn't even hit the belly. How did he get armor in that? Peach Fuzz, you never cease to amaze me, my friend. Especially with King K rule of all characters, oh my god. Up till up B, oh my god, pulling all the stops there. Whiffing that finishing touch, unfortunately for Mortem. But this is huge, there it is. Oh, missing the F smash just by a little bit there. Let's go team, red team. Oh, giving them the clap, clap them cheeks. Shout outs to Cheeks, the cloud player. Followed me on Instagram for some reason. All right, one, two punch, one, two. Just like Doc Lewis, and stomping on him. Good first game there from the red team. Let's see if they can carry this momentum for the rest of the set and make it to grand finals. That would be pretty nice, if I do say so myself. Plus, it would be a pretty huge upset, because like I said, Mortem and Stas have been the undisputed number one seed in doubles for the last couple months. And it's already a pretty big deal that Hunger and Rockstar upset them on winner's side. And now if they lose to Gonard and Peach Fuzz, they'd be out at third. I don't know how they'd feel about that. Same characters, of course. All right, let's see what happens. Game two now. God, that coin launcher theme is so good. Oh, I love it. Love it, love it, love it. Town and city for game two. All right, makes sense. Very camping friendly stage. Uh, gives both players a lot of room to get their limit break and deep breathing. 
Not to mention, Wii Fit's his owner, so you know. That's how it be sometimes. Alright, Don Eagle forward smash. Wow, already at 100%. Good stuff from Gonard, uh, racking up that damage. Oh, but Mortem's there waiting with his limit break. They're just putting the pressure on him, not letting him breathe. Alright. Unsafe, la uh, unsafe empty landing there. Calling out the high recovery there with the uh, up angled forward smash. One two punch, calling out the deep breathing there. Alright, yeah, now red team definitely feeling themselves. Don't want to jinx them. I'd love to see them win this. Nothing against Stas and Mortem, it's just, you know, Gonar and Peach Fuzz are my boys. Good stuff there from Stas. Oh, almost getting the F smash, but Little Max frame one jab coming in clutch there. All in all, kind of even game. Slight advantage for a team, I'd say. Limit on deck now. Gonard being kind of reckless with his smash attacks there. Oh, barely missing that free forward smash there. Uh, oh, unfortunately for Stash, he interrupted the limit cross slash there, which uh, gave uh, Peach Fuzz an extra breath of life there. All right. A lot of players at the kill percent now. All right, let's see this. Is he going to close out Mortem's uh, second stock? Uh, but no, they will close out Stas' first stock. That was a kind of questionable limit cross slash there. Back throw, or the deep breathing forward tilt from Stas will close out Mortem. Sending him down now to his last stock. It's not looking good for uh, Mortem. Stas probably isn't worried, but Mortem though. You never know, he might just die again and then be forced to take Stas' stock. And just like that, wow. Wow, okay. Red team found themselves in a very favorable position right now. Don't want to jinx him, of course. All right, good pressure there from Gonard. We fit, uh, doesn't have any like super easy out of shield options besides back there. Oh, no DI there from Gonard. Gonna die very early, unfortunate. They still have the percent lead, but like, it's doubles. Who cares about percent? Ah, uh, one, two punch. Oh, would you look at this. Running into that cross slash, not that it matters anyway. All right. A little profiling with the down tilt there. I like it. Good stuff from Gonard. All right, running into the cross slash again. The hitbox extending, extending hitting uh, Peach Fuzz. Both players very careful right now because they don't want to inadvertently hit each other. Little Mac hitting K uh, roll with a forward smash at the ledge. This percent would be pretty bad. Mortem doing a great job right now of just walling the players out, not letting them get in. Limit break almost on deck. This could be the game changer. There it is. What's he gonna do? Good parry there. You cannot punish that move. You literally can't punish a limit cross slash. That's absolutely ridiculous. And the KO punch. There it is. Game two going to Gonard and Peach Fuzz. Now then, Mortimer Stas. They need to pull reverse 3 0 if they want to move on to Grands. This is looking very, very good for Team King KO punch right now. I'd, um, uh, I'd like to see them pull this off, honestly. I would not be opposed to seeing Gonar and Peach Fuzz just getting the epic dub. Going on to Grants to fight against Rockstar and Hunger. No character changes. Let's do this. Game three. Gonar and Peach Fuzz, will you close this out? Or will you get reverse 3 0 Or drop a game? I don't know. I just, please, guys, please just win this. Please go to Peach Fuzz. Let's go. Game three. Town and city running back. We fit and Cloud both very fond of the stage. Last game, uh, it wasn't like a super convincing win, but I will say, Gonard's KO punches certainly came in clutch. He landed like three of them last game. Oh, who's this? Is this the man, the myth, the legend? Bones? Sup? Not much. Good to see you, buddy. All right, here we are. Losers finals of game three. Got yeah, knocked out already, so that's rough. All right. Well, I, I'm improving. It's just I'm still getting like four of them. Oh, no worries, man. You're getting there. Don't worry. Anyway, um, blue team doing a much better job this game compared to the last game. Uh, Gonard at a pretty high percent. Could easily lose his stock any second now. Watch out! Oh, that was very risky. But luckily, he's just baiting Stas off stage so she can just burn more uh, deep breathing. Where's the plot armor? Uh, I'm not sure. I think the plot armor's on the red team's <laughs> side this game. There's that. Oh, he's fishing for that I crossbow. Thought, I thought, uh, I thought Mortem and Stas had that really thick plot armor. Yeah, but Peach Fuzz and Gonar, they're the underdogs here. 
Because Mortem and Stas have been the undisputed uh, top team at ABB for a long oh, yeah, time for, now. For doubles? Oh, yeah. absolutely. Good forward smash there. For oh, yeah. They're, they're just slow, super switched on. Yeah. And, uh, are Gonard and Peach Buds usually uh, doubles partners? Yes, actually. They've been doing it quite frequently lately. They have been. They did pretty good last year. Yeah, and, uh, I believe two weeks ago they won, actually. But uh, granted, Mortem wasn't here. Yeah. Yeah, Spike Zillion confirms it. Shout out to Spike Zillion. <laughs> Captain of Team Piss, of course. All right. Um, so yeah, this is not looking great for the red team. Oh yeah, they're a high percentage. They're basically they're basically a kill percent. Yeah, especially with the Wii Fit deep breathing. Ooh, Calling out the spot charge there. Point. I like it. Oh There's my god! Clap. Good stuff from Go uh, Peach Fuzz. That's clapping. That's slapping clap, Junior. <laughs> yeah. Oh Get man. All right, good forward there. Not forward. looking too good for red team, but let's see what good old Peach Fuzz does here. Not yeah. much because he gets back out of the shield. Yeah. <laughs> All right, K guys. Doesn't, K Rule doesn't have that much going for him in terms of mix ups, you know. He, he yeah. kind of just needs to throw a hitboxes and hope his uh, belly armor pulls through. Yeah, unfortunate stuff there for the red team. We're going to see a game four now. Oh, there's their specialty, uh, oh. Congo Falls with Gangplank Galleon. Oh, hell yeah. Can we turn that on? I don't know if we can hear it. Uh, oh, we don't have control of the game audio, unfortunately. But anyway, game four now, Battlefield. I know Stas and Mortem like this stage too, but it's a good stage for all four of these characters, I'd say. Yeah, yeah, I, I think it's a little more blue team flavored just because Little Mac is gonna have a lot of trouble, you know, getting up. Well, actually in this game, his full hop can actually go onto a platform now. Whereas in Smash 4, he had to burn both his regular jump and his double jump to get up onto a platform. I didn't know that. I didn't play Smash yeah. so. Oh, you didn't miss much, my friend. Trust me. Still had to Mortem. Yeah, no. Shut out some Mortem. Uh, Alright. KO Punch on deck now. One wrong move from the blue team can cost him dearly. Or oh, camping the ledge with the ball. Very nice stuff. Yeah, red team in a bad spot. Very bad spot right now. Good down air from Stas. That was a weird interaction going for the counter. Didn't, didn't, you know, get anything out of it. It's just crazy. Yeah. Mortem throwing out the side B effectively this time. Oh my god, oh up B all the way god. in the blast zone. Very nice stuff from Gonard. Jacob's ladder all the way to the top. Yeah, he's... he's... Gonard is honestly the kind of player who thinks it's not over till it's over. He can be down three stocks, Ooh. and he'll still keep on fighting like a champ, because he's got a heart of a lion. Never give up, no matter what. Yeah. Always go for the recovery, even if it's pointless. Just to stall out time. Yeah, okay. There's a, there's a reason for that. Oh, man. This is looking really, really rough for the red team. And imagine the blue team, after those first two games, they seem to have found their footing much better now. Spotted that side B from a mile away. Yeah, all right. Nice force match. just loves to let it rip. He just... He's got limit, you can see that side B coming. Yeah, he's very impatient with his limit usage. Oh, very unfortunate, Mortem trying to take Peach Fuzz down with him. Did not get the spike, I don't uh, protect Oh, okay, deep breathing's gone. This is suddenly looking a lot more doable now. The than juggles. It, yeah. Oh, yeah. I didn't even realize that red team's down. Oh, oh boy. All right, last time That's it, oh, not quite. All right, let's see what he does. He's Lim on the platform. He's at a bad spot for a little back, but... oh. Nice forward smash. Oh, cross that's slash. Nice damage. It. Yeah, but that's, that's it. not it either. Recovering high, because sometimes you just got to do it, you know? Oh, yeah. Oh, what? Oh, the taunt oh. bait. Oh. He's playing like a punch-out opponent right now, just baiting him out. Oh, look at taunt that. Taunt body? Okay, okay. He can do this, actually. He can... Oh, boy. Okay. Not going to... That's not... Okay. No. Unfortunately, yeah, uh, yeah, it looks like it. All right, looks like we're gonna see a game five now. Uh, I was hoping Gonard and Peach Fuzz would just clean up, where's, you know. Where's Oats? Where's Oats? You gotta tell Oats about this plot armor. I think he's upstairs right now. I don't right. think he didn't, I don't think he signed up yet. Oh, really? Yeah. He, I thought he usually played doubles. He's doing singles this time? Oh, uh, no, he's not doing singles either. Oh, what? Yeah, no. Oh, so he's running it? I, uh, no, I think he's just, uh, 
I think when singles start, he's going to do some dream control. Like, he's going to take over for Andrew there. Okay, we're seeing a switch now to Game & Watch. Peach was done joking around with his old K rule. And uh, let's see what happens now. He's finished with that. Okay, oh, hell five. yeah. Gaming Watch is such a good doubles character just because he's so chaotic. Yeah, you never know when that, like, nine hammer will just come in and oh, yeah, steal a but, stock. Like, it's just... Like, the hitboxes, good recovery, a lot more mix up, just a lot more tools than, like, what K Rule has. A lot oh. more combo potential. And up air is so good at juggling, especially in doubles. Oh, definitely. Now, not that Stas was even using it that much to begin with, but I'd imagine she's gonna be very mindful about using Sun Salutation against Game & Watch, just for the fact that if he buckets it, that's uh... A, that's a dead person right there. Definitely. Oh. Yeah. Alright. Uh, unfortunately, Gonard missed spacing on P uh, Mortem's shield there. Gonna get up to the shield. That's a oh. oh, would you look at that! Forward wow. smash and KO punch! Alright, excellent start there from the red team. Oh no, deep breathing forward tilt. Not gonna kill. Good two frame at the ledge there for Mortem though. These juggles are so weird, getting only parts of the multi hit, but still the Oh uh, no. Unfortunately, Gonard killing his own teammate. Yeah, very unfortunate and stuff. Kurt, Beach Fuzz nearly doing the same. Pu oh, not getting the punish on that cross slash, unfortunately. Oh man, this is just. Oh no, Pe Gonard just keeps running into all these attacks. Ah, oh, yeah, what you look at that. Um, Stas, unfortunately, getting hit by the limit blade beam. Oh, oh no, Peach Fuzz is dead. That is... Th Stas is dead! Okay, okay. This is still doable, okay. Advantage red team. Oh, definitely. This is uh, this is looking pretty good for him right now. All right, that's going to be death, though, yeah. Right. Gonard needs to be very conservative with his up B usage. Right. Like, you can't throw it in a, 2v1, in a 2v2. Oh, man, I can't believe that traded. I thought Lumax smash attacks were just supposed to go through everything except like a focus attack. They're great. Just run around. It's like it's kinda like Marth from Melee where you basically just dash dance and throw something out. And just get away with it, honestly. Just get away with it. It's great. Oh, there's the cross slash, good damage, comboing into the ball. Damage, but it's not gonna kill. Going hard recovering high, smart stuff. Up B out of shield, not gonna kill quite. Yeah, Stas uh Stas and Kerm uh Peach Fuzz. Both in pretty unfavorable positions. That's there, oh, that's it. That's a dead smash and now, player. yep, rip smash four. I feel like Gonard probably gonna gone for a side B after that down tilt. Okay, I don't want to say this is an advantage for the red team. That's why. It's a really good back there. Yeah, taking the stop. <gasps> Nine in Gonard's shield. That is very scary. Very scary stuff. Good recovery from Gonard, making it back. You don't want a nine-year-old player. Definitely not. I think they need to get rid of Stas as soon as possible. Deep breathing. Too strong. Yeah. Limit as well, that's also scary. Just throwing it out though. Up here to shield. All right, this is very scary stuff. Gangplank, Galleon playing. Oh no, the back air. Ooh, can Blue this Team is, do this? Are they gonna get the reverse 3-0 or is Peach Fuzz gonna clutch it out? Whoa. Honestly, I, he should just focus down Stas, honestly. Oh, good reflection there. Good bucket. Oh, gosh. Ooh, that was risky down smash. Doesn't get punished. Well, uh, good usage of the back air, though, gotta say. Yeah. All right, no, he's just... playing very well considering he's on his own. It's not over yet. He can still... Oh, no, that's it. Over. That's not no, it. Not. Oh, man. Staying alive. Look at him go. She loves those big four tail hitboxes. Oh, oh, man. Not gonna kill. Wow, that's wow. a kill? That's very surprising. Oh, that's dead. Oh, what? Oh. No. Oh, very clever, man. very clever by Mortem to see that. I don't think I like. I think he would have been dead if he went for the forward smash. Yeah, but that was like the best option. Yeah. Okay. Good stuff from Mortem and Stas.